Ohio Creative Portfolio and Agency WordPress theme. It supports Elementor and WP Bakery. Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to install and demo import Ohio Portfolio and Agency WordPress theme and also set up the home pages, menu items and headers. So without wasting time, let's see how to do this. If you want to purchase hosting a hosting, please use our referral link to get 20% off. The link is in the description. To install the theme, first go to the WordPress dashboard, then go to appearance, then click themes. Then click add theme and click upload theme. Here choose file. Now locate the Ohio theme unzip bundle. Once you unzip the Ohio theme bundle, you will get following files. Here you can see this is Ohio main theme. This is the child theme and this is importer. So here have to note that Ohio theme is around 15 MB size. So click that theme and click open. Now click install now. Once installed, click activate. Okay, now the theme is activated. After the theme activation, following messages will appear. It asks you to install the following plugins. So click begin installing plugins. The same thing you can done here. Go to appearance and here you can see install plugins. So both ways you can install the plugins. So let's click begin installing plugins. Now select all the plugins. So select what plugins all uh, plugins are selected so bulk action click install now click apply now it will install the required plugin one by one okay once the required plugin installation complete following message will appear return return to required plugin installer so click this one now you have to activate all the plugins we have installed again click this plugin select activate click apply okay now you can see all the required plugins have been installed and activated okay let's see how to import the demo data first refresh this dashboard okay once you refresh you can see okay your theme is appearing here here you can see import demo import so let's click this demo import so here you can see there are so many demo websites available demo 1 to demo 33 and other variations are available so let's see how to import the first demo data so if you want you can open this in a new tab and you can see how websites appear like you can see it's appear like this so there are so many demo sites available for your choice so you can select one of the demo sites. if you want to see this one okay so second one fits better for me so let's import the second one so click this import so here it will ask for import for wp bakery import for elementor import for elementor section so depend on the website builder you had you can choose the uh, import method so if you are using with wp bakery web builder you can select this one if you're familiar with the elementor you can use this one so i am familiar with elementor so i click this import for elementor so it will take few minutes depend on the internet and the hosting speed so please wait for that once the import is complete you will get following message import complete the demo template has been successfully imported so let's open website in the new tab now you can see the demo data have been imported but that is not as similar as the original demo once you see the original demo it is like this but in our imported data you can see there's no menu here it's asking you to please assign a menu and only the blog posts are available here so how to fix that for that again go back to the wordpress dashboard go to appearance here click menus in the menu you can see though there's no proper menu here so let's create create a proper primary menu so click create menu here let's give a name for this menu so you can give menu name as a primary menu now you can see the home page is the custom custom link so you can remove that those ones so you can remove this one and the cart is no need so you can remove this as well check out also you can remove so this is the demo to design bureau is the one we have selected for the home page that is uh, built by the elementor so you can keep this one uh, and you can remove this one sample page remove this ones and also you can uh, change the name so for this demo to decide bureau you can change the name as form so here you can change the navigation label as home and you can save the menu okay on the left side you can see the pages so here you can click view all so here you can select any pages you want to display here the home already there cart and checkers no need to put it also here you can go in the categories you can see there are categories available for example digital marketing marketing and categorize 
So if you want to display the items in categorically, you can select these two as well. So click add to menu. So those two items are added here. So if you want to add any other categories, you can add also. Okay, once it's done, you can click save menu. And don't forget the menu settings, auto add pages, automatically add new top level pages into the menu. So you can select this one and display location. You can select this as a primary. So once you select primary only, it will display it in the main header of your website. Okay, now we have saved. Let's open the page now. Now you can see still the blog page is appearing. The reason is, you are not set up the home page as the front page. So set up the preferred page as the home page. Again, go back to the dashboard. Here, go to settings and click reading. So here you can see the home page displays your latest posts, but you want to display the static page. That is the demo page you want to display. So select this one, a static page. And here you can select demo to that is design bureau so this is the one you want to display so this is the home page now click save changes now let's open the website in a new tab and see now you can see the preferred demo page is appearing as the home page you can see this is the website name and the home page is by default appearing the demo page we have selected so this is how you can manage to display the demo page you preferred so here you can see all the contents are available. You, now you can edit, start to edit the header and footer part of the uh, website and also you can edit each elements of the website. For that, you can click this edit, edit with Elementor. So here you can see in a testimonial V1, V2, V3 you can edit. So let's click this one. Let's so skip this one. Now you can see all the contents are editable. So you can click this pen icon and you can edit here and all other items you can edit visually. So this is how you can Simply install demo import and edit the Ohio WordPress theme contents. So if you want more detailed uh, customization of this theme, please subscribe our channel and wait for our new videos. Thank you. <music>